Hello, you might have seen my video on the Razer Wolverine V3 Pro firmware update. I will also link it below in the description. One thing I noticed afterwards was that my V3 Pro was vibrating way too much in games and actually also when listening to music. You can fix this behavior quite easily and I would like to show you in this video here how. So if we go into the Razer Synapse app, we can modify the haptic intensity of our controller. We can turn it on, we can turn it off, and we can also select the strength of the vibration. What we cannot select here is what triggers the rumble functionality. And the default setting will also trigger based on audio. So if we have our V3 Pro turned on and listen to a song on YouTube, this happens here. And the same also with in-game music. Now, in order to modify this behavior to our preference, we need to install also the Razer Chroma app. I will leave you the link to the installer below. Once installed, the Chroma app also detects our Wolverine V3 Pro and lets us choose the so-called haptic source. By default, this is set to audio to haptics, which explains also the dancing of the controller when listening to music. So what we can do now is either adjust the setting and the sensitivity of the audio related rumble effect or we change the setting to Sensor HD Games. With the latter, the controller does not vibrate anymore based on audio feedback, but only on the events that the game explicitly sends to the controller to activate a rumble effect. So I will keep it now with Sensor HD Games and close the Chroma app, and then we will see that the controller does not vibrate anymore in in-game menus or just based on the game's music, but only on specific gameplay-related events in the game like explosions and so on. All right, works nicely for me now. I hope you can find also the best setup for your Wolverine V3 Pro. Until next time.